Good morning. Today, this is Bedtime Stories with Grandad. And today, we have an absolutely lovely story. It's about a hare. And it's called, Guess How Much I Love You. Little nut brown hare was going to bed. Held on t- going to bed, held on tight to big nut brown hair's very long ears. He wanted to be sure that big nut brown hair was listening. Guess how much I love you, he said. Oh, I don't think I, I could guess that, said big nut brown hair. This much, said little nut brown hair, stretching out his arms as wide as they could go. Big nut brown hair had even longer arms. But I love you this much, he said. Hmm, that's a lot, thought little nut brown hair. I love you as high as I can reach, said little nut brown hair. I love you as high as I can reach, said Big Nut Brown Hair. That's quite a lot. That's quite high, thought Little Nut Brown Hair. I wish I had arms like that. Little Nut Brown Hair had a good idea. He tumbled upside down and reached up up the tree trunk with his feet. I love you all the way up to my toes, he said. And I love you all the way up to your toes, said Big Nut Brown here, swinging him over his head. I love you as high as I can hop, laughed Little Nut Brown Hare, bouncing up and down. But I love you as high as I can hop, smiled Big Nut Brown Hare. He hopped so high that his ears touched the branches above. That's good hopping, thought Little Nut Brown Hare. I wish I could hop like that. I love you all the way down the lane, as far as the river, cried Little Nut Brown Hare. I love you across the river and over the hills, said the big nut brown hair. That's very far, thought little nut brown hair. He was almost too sleepy to think any more. Then he looked beyond those the thorn bushes out into the big dark night. Nothing could be further than the sky. I love you right up to the moon, he said, and closed his eyes. Oh, that's far, said Big Nut Brown Hair. That is very far. But Nut Brown Hair settled Little Nut Brown Hair into his bed of leaves. He leaned over and kissed him good night.